It's beer and food o'clock on Real Ale Craft Beer and I've been left on the hop in today's video. I was about to get the air fryer out, put it on the bar and cook some of these schnitzel viner art, Viennese style pork scallops from Lidl. Just about to bang them in the air fryer, reading on the back of the box, you have to fry them either deep fry them or shallow fry them. So we've got this machine thing, this, uh, I can't remember. what do they call it? They'll come to me in a moment. But we got a beer. This is the Bischoff Original Fest beer, 5.4% ABV. There's the bottle cap. Uh, so the reason why we're pairing the, the, the Alpen Fest with this is that I just picked something out the freezer that I picked up from Lidl. We bought the 10 beers in Lidl in the box for £25, making it £2.50 a beer. And this is what happens in life, isn't it? You kind of, you, you, you set things up and, and things go wrong and not necessarily wrong, but you get caught on the hop in life. So let's start off by trying to switch this thing on. It would really help if I plugged the damn thing in wouldn't it right we have power um, and then uh, uh, I'm just gonna press some buttons yeah that doesn't ah right something just happened Grab the schnitzel. Ah, they're in, they're packed in two. Right, we just boosted it. So these fry for three minutes. Haha, <laughs> don't you love a plan? Right, beer. Fish off shoff original fast beer then. Hopefully it's not so manic anymore. I can't call it manic Monday. I should call it manic Tuesday, shouldn't I? <laughs> so what seems to have happened here is ah there we are. No, go back on, boost. Right. Beer in the glass. Let's do the thing that I'm good at, and let's let's start off with the beer review. Uh, we got a three finger white head, good levels of carbonation on the beer, straw coloured beer. This smoke. I'm still trying to still trying to think of the name of the cooking thing. It's like a not a, a, a convection, not convection. Newfangled way of cooking food. Uh, a three finger white head, good levels of carbonation, straw coloured beer, um, very clear to look at. It looks really good. Get the aroma. It smells good. It smells really good. I haven't even got a knife, from, a knife and fork to eat it. We'll have to eat it with a spatula. Yeah, it smells good. It's 
light, crisp. Very stinging nettle like, spicy, peppery. Let's dive in. Cheers, everybody. Absolutely fantastic beer. Makes the chaos very much worth it when you've got a really good beer like this. I mean, what I could have done is settled myself down, got everything set up properly, you know, worked out how to use this damn cooking thing. Convention! It's a convention grill oven thing. And done it properly. But I thought to myself, no, that's not real life. It's not real life, is it? Real life is very much like this, where you're starving hungry and you're rattling around for stuff and you've got to, you read the back of the packet and it won't go in the air fryer and you need a frying pan and, and, and all hell breaks loose. That's normal life. This is what I like to bring you on the channel. What I'm, so what I'm doing with this thing is that I'm pressing the boost button. I can't work out how to just knock it up Ah, hang on, I have worked it out. Anyway, forget about that damn thing. Let's get into the beer. The beer is super crisp, super refreshing, really lovely, light, crispy, oh man, stinging nettle. You could drink about three or four pints of this. It's very nice, very nice beer. I know, I know I had some people in the comments box of the unboxing video saying they had, they tried the fish off and um, they didn't like it. They thought um, it was either too bitter or not quite right. But I think, I think for a, so what style would I call this? I'd say this is more like a stronger Helles Lager. You've got the nice bit of sweetness over there. And then you've got that nice bit of bitterness over there. Stinging nettle flavours. Um, is it a fire behind me? Um, <laughs> um, and, and it's just, it's just super lovely and crisp and refreshing. It's just fried for three minutes, but do you know, do you know what worries me about frying things for three minutes? Is I worry that the pork's not going to be cooked in the middle. You're going to be eating like frozen, frozen meat. But it's definitely been over three minutes, haven't it? I want to try and pair it with this. Should we go for it? I want to pair it with this, uh, with this fast beer. I'll tell you what we'll do. We'll Cut it in the middle. Oh. I have to cook it for longer. This is probably the most bizarre video. I've ever made on the channel. Let's just drink the beer. Forget about that thing. It's going to be too hot to eat anyway, isn't it? 
It's going to be a bit of pork with some batter. That's what it's going to be. A little bit of pork with a little bit of batter on the outside. It's going to be like a bit of frozen fish, isn't it? But with pork in it. It would have been nice to... Right, we got some. Never give up in life. Never give up, never surrender. Here we are, it's turned off now. What I'm gonna do, I'm gonna re finish reviewing the beer. I really drank the whole pint. <laughs> I'm gonna finish reviewing this beer after all that chaos, and then we'll try the schnitzel thing. If you think about this for one minute, how quickly I've drank the beer. It's so tasty. It's just kind of like just flown back. Absolutely flown back. Absolutely lovely beer. Crisp, refreshing, in between like a Helles Lager and a Pilsner style of beer. Uh, it's just all good. It's just really, really good, tasty, solid German beer. And again, it's part of that 10 box, 10 beers in the box. So it, it comes in at £2.50 a bottle. I think that's excellent value for money. Absolutely excellent value for money for the first beer. 5.4% ABV. Pardon me. Wow, deep fried schnitzel. That's good. Mmm. Yeah, it's like a pork chop. Whoa. Oh, yeah. Oh, that is fantastic. We got that in the end, didn't we? Mmm. It's a pork or scallop. Oh, but the, the way it's been fried, it's, it's juicy. The juices from the pork is, oh, that's amazing. Mm. That is really, really, really good food. Oh, look at that. Right. The schnitzel, I like that enough to give it a 9 out of 10. 9 out of 10 for the schnitzel. Schnitzel Viner Art from Lidl. About £2.50 a box. And the beer is equally as fantastic. 9 out of 10. Thanks for the chaos. Thanks for watching. Please put your comments in the comments box. Subscribe to our daily beer and food reviews. Give us a big fat thumbs up. Boom. Cheers.